Hi everyone, I'm here at the Qoshaya Monastery, Maronite Monastery in Lebanon. And I'm going to show you how stalactites and stalagmites are made. I'm about to take you into a 5th century space where monks who were living here would worship. There's a, a religious piece of this but I'm not going to cover that, I'm just going to talk about the geology. So all of these mountains here are limestone, you can see, and there's a great deal of water. And what do you get when you get limestones and water? You get stalactites and stalagmites. So we enter the cave. And we're walking. Now you can see these round formations here. They look wet, but they're actually made of stone. And if you look up, they come from stalactites that are dripping. And so they drip and then they form. And then so And they form big, brown, nascent. When the water doesn't have space to fall, it creates these other formations. So the water falls from these. <laughs> from these hollow tubes like straws and it touches the ground. And you see, it's hard. So that's how you make stalactites and stalagmites courtesy of this monastery in Lebanon.